Okay, so Nogi Voice is shine. I'm actually not too sure about myself, but I know it's one that people actually want to explain, so I will do my best, see if I can find out what it is that troubles people here. Um, first of all, you need to go down, and uh, with the strat I'm going to explain, you need to go for this bubble, that's the first bubble to the bottom right. Um, there's a lot of strat where you want to do, go for this one to the left instead, but I'm, for my strat, go for the bottom right um, to get your air. The reason for this is that the other strat goes for air damage, but that doesn't work in the Japanese version, so I'm going for something else. Anyway, you keep dropping until you hear the, the eel. Uh, like it's spinning now, but you want to listen for the eel to make its uh, its sound. That means it's about to go up, and then you hover at that time. Uh, so listen for that, and hover at the same time. Um, you just keep hovering for as long as possible, try to clean the teeth. Now. This is a part where a lot of people have trouble. I never really had a problem here, but anyway, when you clean the teeth, try to hit like the inside of them, not the top of them, the inside of them. And this is just like any graffiti and stuff. You don't need to actually hit the part you want to clean, just the object. So as long as you hit this area, you clean all of the tooth. And that goes for all of them. Try to hit the inside of them, not the top of them. Like there, and there. Like pay attention to exactly where I hit. It's never on, on the top of them, it's always in the back. And the same for this one. Also, something I forgot to mention is that I do a short hover after the first 40, and then I go for the next one. And then clean this one. Once again, you kind of listen for it to react, and then you start hovering up. Keep hovering up uh, until it opens its mouth again, and use first person to turn around, clean this tooth, get back inside, hover up. Uh, how about for pretty long here, uh, a bit longer than you might think. Um, then turn around and clean this too. And once again you go inside the mouth and okay, so here you want to land around this dark area of his mouth, right? And as soon as you start closing it you hover. You hover a little bit outside and then back in. And as soon as he starts opening it again, you stop hovering and you just start aiming and shooting the two. And after that you just need some faith and you will see that this is gonna work. Uh, like hover out, back in, stop hover, switch to uh, the normal nozzle, and just aim for this tooth. Just do that and you will get hit, and that will skip the cutscene. Just watch here. Clean, 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 bam, and uh, you got the cutscene skip. And that's actually one thing I forgot to mention, I will just mention this here at the end. Um, when the eel turns around his head, uh, once it opens its mouth, look if uh, this tooth up here is gold or not. If it's gold, you want to go the other way around, because it's actually, you want to finish with the gold tooth. You don't have to, but it's a lot easier to hit, uh, to skip the cutscene. And uh, that's all there is to the eel. I hope this helps.